Was it was a little bit of a scare the other day when you had to sit out? Um, nah, it was. It really was. I knew it was like a false positive test. Um, I tested positive first, then negative 30 minutes later. So um, I knew I'd be back. You know, just some misunderstanding. That's all. How's, how's, how's the hamstring holding up through the first 10 days of camp? I'm good. You know, um, I got my routine down pat. You know, I do certain stuff at certain times. I get here at a, a certain time every day. Um, you know, staying up on my fluids and, you know, just happy to be out, you know, out here with the guys, playing ball with them, you know, being back to my normal self. So. Being under one routine for this entire year as opposed to last year where you're kind of bouncing around? Yeah, because, you know, being under a routine I can find um, good for myself um, has been awesome for me. You know, I didn't know what was the right things to do, you know, um, do I do cupping today before practice or after practice? You know, some stuff you just got to take in the, you know, um, just got to take it with a, with a grain of salt. You just got to focus on that stuff. There's things that work for you as mo uh, for the most part, and then just keep going with it. We've seen you work some special teams in front the military. How much do you want to try and win that job with one of those guys? Hey, I, I want to do anything that's going to help this team. You know, um, if they want to put me back there, punt return, kick return, I'm comfortable back there. Um, you know, I'm still learning um, a lot of the returns and still learning from Coach Midge and, and Big Spence. You know, Big Spence has been a great part of my life, you know, just teaching me all the ways. You know, he's been doing this now for three or four years. So, you know, I'm just, I be on his hip all the time, just learning, like, you know, how would you catch the ball on this? Would you fair catch it? Things of that nature. So um, just learning from them, those guys and just, you know, going out there and just playing with speed. You to win that job, the punt returner job specifically, you have to improve your, your catching ability. How much do you think you've improved over this past year? I think I've improved a lot. You know, I think, you know, being less jittery back there and more, you know, calm and relaxed, you know, that was my main thing about, you know, me coming in the, you know, from college to the NFL was, you know, I was always jittery back there, you know, worried about who's in front of me instead of just being relaxed. So, you know, um, I, I, don't muff a lot of, I don't muff a lot of punts no more, so I'm more comfortable back there. Um, Seth, Seth is, you know, he's progressing real good, you know. Um, he's, uh, he's starting to understand things. He's starting to know, you know, which read he is so he can take his time on certain routes. You know, um, all we got to do is just, you know, get his fatigue. You know, he'd be tired sometimes, but, you know, it's normal. We're in Colorado, mile high, so he's got to get used to it. But um, everything else, he's, he's coming along real good. Yep. When you have a pileup like uh, Garrett and Bradley there, do you, are you a spectator or do you dive in there trying to break it up? Um, you know, football, football is football, you know. Um, I try to stay away from that stuff. Um, you know, we don't want nobody getting hurt and stuff, so I didn't really get a good glimpse of it. So, you know, I try to stay out of that stuff like that. Uh, joint practices next week in Minnesota. What kind of opportunity will that be for you to sort of test yourself against another team? Um, it's good. You know, I feel like it's just like any other football game. It's just like any other football game. and. Um, you know, I, this is my second year, so this, this really ain't nothing, really. So just going out there and playing ball. Where do, you, where do you find your role on this offense coming together now that you've had kind of a full camp? Um, I want to be the playmaker. I want to be the spark to this offense. Um, you know, you know, it's a lot. It's a lot of it's a lot of talent on that offense. You know, you got Noah. You know, all the guys on the receiving corps. You got the running backs and stuff like that. So then you got Drew and, and Teddy at quarterback. So. You know, I take, you know, every opportunity I got to make a, I got to make a play with it, you know, because you don't know how many opportunities you might get. And like some days you might get six balls, some days you might get one. So, you know, just take every opportunity. Um, I'm blessed that I'm, I'm here, you know, blessed that I'm part of the Broncos organization. So I just try my best and just being me every day. Is there any questions here the fastest guy on the team? Ain't no question about it. Ain't no question about it at all. What about TB fast. We, we, me, and T, me and TB always talk about building a four by one team. We trying to figure out who the anchor would be, so we still trying to figure that out. But I don't know. Me and TB don't need to race. We already know. We already know. It's, what's understood don't need to be said. Thank you. Have a blessed one.